The Prime Minister was in East New Britain province early this week to launch the rehabilitation of the 10 megawatt Warangoi hydropower project in rural Pomio. The 83 million kina rehabilitation hydroelectricity facility will boost the low production of Warangoi hydropower facility. Warangoi hydropower facility was originally commissioned in 1983 but has been supplying below its rated capacity of 10 megawatts into the gazelle breed for the last 10 years. Rehabilitation of the project was made possible through the Asian Development Bank and the government of PNG co-funded Town Electrification Investment Program. PM James Marape assured landowners that they will be paid the 5 million kina they've asked for for use of their land and water. He also appealed to them to organize themselves in preparation for the next phase of the project further up the Warangoi River. The Prime Minister said this rehabilitation project was part of the Pangu Party's flagship policy of creating economic independence for the people of Papua New Guinea. And in this context, the government went to East New Britain by choice because it is a very good foundation province for the government to anchor its focus on rural-based industries like agriculture and downstream processing. But all this, said the Prime Minister, will depend on reliable power, reliable infrastructure and reliable internet. Solomon Vincent, TV1 News.